All right, everybody, welcome back to the Bomb Squad. We're doing The Walking Dead, and time to go into this heaping pile of shit that we're in now. Here we go. There we go. Go, Kenny. Go, Krusty Chuck. Oh, mids, leaks. Leg seems to be feeling a hell of a lot better. No! Hey. Oh God, no! Ben's gonna leave her! You fucking bitch! I swear to God, you're dead to me! No! I shot directly! Krusty Chuck, you better not die me, Ben! I swear! You are done! Please, God, no! Oh, now his leg's fucked up again, huh? Ben! I'll get the door. You okay? Uh, yeah. You wasn't, opened up your wound. You're bleeding. I wasn't talking to him. I was talking to Clementine. We gotta get him inside. Clean him up. Kenny, how's that door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll work faster. We just won't be long before those things outside figure out where we went. You know they can smell blood. Lady, I ain't the one who's bleeding. Quit it, the pair of you. Gonna bring more of them down on us. Let's see if I can find a way in. There. You. About what happened back there on the street. I know. I don't know what happened. I just froze up. Hasn't that ever happened to you? No! That's what I'm saying to you. You put that girl in danger again. It won't be walkers you have to worry about. I hear you. Think we can get in through one of these windows? Man, I don't think so. You mother... Yeah, looks pretty solid. How do you think Kenny felt about it? I don't know. All we can think about is finding a boat. He definitely doesn't want to talk about Katya and Doc. At least not with me. I understand, because you're a little bitch who fucking runs out on Clementine! Do you think the dead people saw us come back here? Are they going to find us? We're not smarter than they are. True that. They're still animals. They can't open doors. We used to have a pet hamster. One night, we figured out how to open the door to his cage. And when we woke up, he'd eaten half a box of cookies. I don't think this is quite yeah. the same, Krill. Yeah, right. Yeah. So the cookies. No, no, no. Okay, I'm going to see about getting this inside the house. Not talking to you. Aha! Well, shit. Clementine, doggy door. No way we're gonna force that open. Not without making a lot of noise, at least. Hey, how you holding up, man? Lady, I appreciate it. 
appreciate the interest, but I don't think talking about my feelings right now is going to help us get inside this house. Respect. How's it going? Find a way in yet? Door's locked up tight. Too heavy to force it without making a whole lot of noise. Maybe there's a better way in. Well, if there is, I ain't seen it. Doggy door. I think I'll go have a look around. Like there's some kind of pet door here. Clementine! I tried it already. That's locked too. Really? Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? I have. My neighbor had one just like that. It's, it's radio controlled. A dog wears a collar with a chip in it, so the door only opens when the dog gets close to it. Bullshit. Every Damn. day school day. Kenny. Alright, so where's the dog? Oh, I gotta go dig it up. Oh. Yeah, like the dog. Be careful. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be, you know what I mean? And how would you know? I'm willing to bet the pet dog. Whatever it is, it's been here a while. Ew, it smells so weird. Gross. Clementine, honey, come sit with me in a minute. Let me work. Yeah, go be with the creepy guy that likes kids. Ben, the only thing I can smell is your fucking pussy. Can't get it off. Okay, that is not cool. Are you okay? I'm fine, honey. It's just the smell. Are you sure you... I am fine, okay? Is, don't even tell me she's pregnant. Don't even tell me that shit. Well, there we go. Now the door's open. Clementine, get in there. Yes! God damn! You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. Let me guess. Here they come. Whatever you're going to do, do it fast. Be careful, man. Ben, shut up. <clears throat> no good. I can't get it. Here, let me try. I think I can. Clem, are you okay? Say something. <laughs> okay. You're very helpful. Good job, Clem. Yeah, way to go. Shut up, Ben! You did good, right? Yes, you did. You did good. Can we maybe have this conversation inside? My leg's starting to hurt like hell. Ben, I... It's okay from here. Everybody in. Everyone else that's crossed my shit list has gotten crossed off of that shit list in one way. By the Grim Reaper's scythe. I'm telling you, you're next, Ben. You're next. That does it, man. You leaving Clementine after I told you to man the hell up? Fucks with that family picture. So, when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. I didn't know it was working. From the other end of that thing. 
You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with the rest of us? I was gonna tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. Who gives a shit about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell. Kenny's got a point. Dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we can see anyone. Yeah, but they warned us. The because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? That's a damn good point. The same thing they gain more. In case you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out there these days. At least the dead don't play games. Whoever that was on the radio, I think they were trying to help us. They did warn us, didn't they? Yeah. Maybe you're right. But whoever it was, they're watching us, following us, and they don't want us to know who they are. Bitch, you just joined this group. Quiet it down outside. We'll all head to the river together. Do you? Suit yourself, and I'm not going to wait around too long for someone else to grab up those boats. That's our. That's what I'm saying. I'm with you, Kenny. Damn. Place seems secure at least. I'll feel better. Shut up, Ben. We need to test the whole house. All right, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you got down here. Make sure you check every door. Yeah, we'll make sure Ben doesn't come back downstairs. Can I help? What if there's another locked door? I don't think you've been helpful enough for one day, kiddo. Why don't you just see if Kristen or me need anything, okay? Okay. Hey, she's more youth, useful. I almost said youthful. Well, I mean, well, she is youthful. Now I'm just going to shut up. So... Ben, I'm, that's, that's it. Ben, 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 I'm telling you, you're next, bitch. You are next. So, I'm, he's not going to live. I'll tell you right now. So, Chuck's out there still. Omid is off his feet. Chris is being a bitch like usual. And Kenny is fine. I We need to go find Krusty Chuck. So, please... Be all right, Krusty Chuck. I believe you're okay. Who the hell rang that bell? We'll hopefully find out in the next episode. Ben's going to die. We need to save Krusty Chuck and find out who rang the bell. So, everybody, we're going to figure that out hopefully next time. So, until then, of course, everybody, join the Bomb Squad. Like, share, and subscribe, and all that fun stuff that I've already mentioned a hundred times that you guys already know about. So, yes, here we go. Until the next time, take care now. Bye-bye then. For God's sakes, y'all stay classy.